Hi, and welcome to my channel, where I share inspiration and practical tips to help you take your modern landscape painting to the next level. In today's video, I'll be showing you three simple steps to improve your landscape paintings. First of all, I would like to invite you on a walk with me while we explore my local landscape and I'll explain all the steps along the way. Step one is to observe the landscape. Take a bit of time and really look at your landscape. Once you have taken it all in, I want you to decide on the most important features about your landscape. The most important features for me are the yellow sky as well as the silhouettes in the foreground of the wintry trees. It's time to head home and get on with step number three, which is to use my sketchbook. The task now is to draw and paint the features that I decided were the most important ones in my landscape. So the yellow sky, as well as the silhouettes and the contrast in between the two. Spend no more than three to five minutes on each sketch. You want to keep it rather simple. I have been painting for more than 25 years and for a long time I felt I was getting distracted by the amount of details in the landscape. So I came up with this three simple steps to help guide me in my painting process. I wanted to simplify my compositions to create strong and powerful paintings that were meaningful to me. When I mention three simple steps, I don't mean three easy steps because simple doesn't necessarily mean easy. But once you practice these steps, they will become easier for you. And I really use this method to train myself to really look and remember the landscape and the colors. And once you practice, you will become really good at uh, capturing the essential features of your landscape. Besides being a full-time professional artist, I also teach others about art and painting and something I noticed with a lot of beginners and something I also experienced myself when I started out is that we have this tendency to want to include way too much detail in our painting. We want, if we're painting from life or from a photo, we want to put all the little details in our painting. We want to paint every single straw of grass or every single leaf. And this is really not necessary most times to get our message uh, across. A subject that a lot of my students want me to talk about is how to simplify and how to um, avoid too much detail. So I decided to do a um, series of videos to show them and to show you guys some of the tips and tricks I learned along the way. I hope you find these videos useful and if you have any suggestions uh, of topics that I could um, talk about and show you in future videos, please feel free to leave a comment uh, 
down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Oh, and I almost forgot to, to tell you that I'm using acrylic paints as well as a little bit of water-soluble crayons. You can, of course, use your own favorite medium. If you prefer oils or colored pencil, just go with that. And remember, the best art materials are the ones you already have. If you would like to see a longer video of how to paint a modern landscape, check out my other videos. And I'll also link to one at the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.